fall potential. So that's great news. Uh, real quick, what's going on in the tropics? Now we have the remnants of Colin that will continue to dissipate through the afternoon hours. It is running into a lot of wind shear and also a cold front is approaching it. So not really, really an issue along the eastern coastline. But we are looking at a tropical wave now entering the Caribbean. It has a 0% chance of any tropical development because it will be moving into an unfavorable environment. And we're still watching uh, Tropical Storm Bonnie, which has crossed over into the eastern Pacific. Not a threat to the area, but it could potentially become a hurricane as early as tonight. So real quick, there's Colin. Most of the convection is off to the east, not really causing much of an issue to coastal North Carolina. But Tropical Storm Bali, Bonnie really getting its act together. You can see that wraparound convection. It is moving to the west at 16 miles per hour with maximum sustained winds of 60 miles per hour. So it is going to continue to strengthen because it is entering a favorable environment, not a whole lot of wind shear and again the water is very warm so it is expected to become a hurricane as early as tomorrow morning and it can potentially become a cat to a hurricane as we head into your Tuesday afternoon. But the good news is really not an impact to any land as it continues to move parallel to Mexico and then it'll continue to head out over the Pacific Ocean. So